Breaking story tonight, a carjacking in southwest Philadelphia ends on the Atlantic City Expressway and with a victim in critical condition. Dave, what are police telling you tonight? Well, Jason, it ends also with the arrest of a 26-year-old woman on the Atlantic City Expressway behind the wheel of one of those cars. This starts around 6 o'clock tonight in the 1900 block of South Ethan Street in southwest Philadelphia. That's where police say a woman in a purple jumpsuit tried to steal a car when the owner intervened. She fired four shots at him. About an hour later, 10 blocks away on the 5600 block of Pentridge Street, the same woman in the same purple jumpsuit, according to police, shot a man in the back and took his white Chevy Equinox. 18th District police officers pursued her through South Philadelphia, and that's where Chief Inspector Scott Small picks up the chase for us. The vehicle then went over the Walt Whitman Bridge into New Jersey and then traveled onto Route 42, and our aviation unit still followed this vehicle overhead. And then the vehicle got onto the AC Expressway heading southbound. When the vehicle got about 15 miles out of the city in New Jersey, it hit a telephone pole or a utility pole. Now. The police tell us a 18th district officers did make the arrest at that scene. TAC Air 1 was also overhead during this chase, which went about 15 miles, lasted about 20 minutes. It was not at a high rate of speed. In fact, police tell us the highest speed the woman reached was about 60 miles per hour on the Atlantic City Expressway. Again, she was not injured. The man who was shot in the carjacking is in the hospital tonight. He is in stable condition with a gunshot wound to his back.